hello everyone so today I am going to uh, use advanced sorry pro builder in unity and then create a sample level like this and I'm going to show you how to do this uh, so the idea the reason I wanted to do this is like I need to have some test areas to further improve my character like staircases ramps and other stuff that I can jump and hang on to like this area so yeah so let's uh, start building this level with the pro builder okay so to proceed with uh, the improvements for my character first I need to develop some kind of a level or test level actually so for that I think I saw something called a pro builder asset in unity uh, yeah this one so I'm going to try this one and make some level so that I can create an example level to test my mechanics oh, version 2x okay install via package manager so it's not good to download it this way all right let's go to packages manager pro builder how can I access it Oh, right here pro builder let's install this right so it is installed mm, I'll close this now now how to use it okay we have this Pro Builder Cube. All right, let's place one of them. Mm, yeah, I think I should. Let's move this to zero, zero, zero. Uh, where is it now? Okay, here. And then I'll enable snapping how to enable a snapping there should be some option to enable a snapping All right, it's here. Edit snap settings. Let me close this. Right, so okay, I'll enable this like this. Okay, now it should snap. Wait, no. All right to snap into work in order to work a snapping I have to key hold control key like this okay um, right now let's start building our level um, I think I don't need this so okay we got some pro builder settings here how to use this
no not a scaling I need to have I think we should have some other okay some other tool set pro builder right I got it so let's go to this this is I think uh, this is object mode yeah this is vertex selection this is edge selection and this is face selection all right got it uh, now all right now I'll select this face and press uh, ctrl E to extrude and another I'll select this face ctrl E to extrude this face ctrl E to extrude right now from this face I'll drag this object like this so that I will have some area and then I'll select this face wait no yeah then I'll press ctrl E to extrude now I can extrude this area like this okay good Mm -mm. what else let me extrude this further let's select the soul and extrude further wait a minute I think I could do that for the ground as well yeah let me select this face and this face and let's move them here oh no no let's select these faces and keep pressing ctrl e cool so the reason to have this uh, this smaller triangles is because now that I can extrude them and create objects as I need so that's why I want to have wanted to have a grid wait let's move the play upwards and if I play the game it is uh, like this okay now let's continue to build mm. okay so now I need to add something like a ramp here the reason is that I want to have a slanted a ramp area so because uh, in the next step I want to create IK system for this character so for that I'll select
these things or oh, maybe that's too far let's select here can I drag and select them oh no Okay, let's extrude them like this. Uh, now I'll select these things and we can merge these faces like this so they act as a single face and then I'll move them down like this okay now we have a ramp let's see if my character can move up oh yeah it can so yeah so now as you can see here um, even though my character is in a slanted area his uh, foot is not matching with the with the slope of the ground so I want to work on that in the next uh, episode so that's why I wanted to create something like this using the pro builder actually I could just drag a cube and make it rotate and do this do the same thing without using the pro builder but uh, I wanted to start using pro builder because uh, first is uh, first thing is that I wanted to show you guys how to use it and then also of course uh, not just this area I wanted to have some other do some other stuff to implement character as well okay now after that let's add let me merge this how to merge them okay I'm not sure why that happens and come here and jump and grab onto this ledge and climb so I want to do stuff like that too okay so I'll stop this episode at this point and uh, oh no maybe we should keep creating some more stuff to make this make this uh, more interesting I think yeah let's add uh, some pillars here okay no I think I'll stop this episode here uh, so let's work on I case tomorrow and if you like to support my work you can get the membership of my patreon club link would be in the description below and thanks for watching see you in the next episode goodbye also the project file will be available through the patreon page